One of the worst critics of Islam is Robert Spencer, and I was listening to a um, a, a podcast or a live cast uh, he was doing with somebody uh, with one ex-Muslim named uh, Harris Sultan, and the reason um, and uh, uh, Robert Spencer was like the reason why he's going after Islam is because Islam or Muslims, uh, well, it, well, the religion of Islam won't leave non-Muslims alone, and I think that's uh, I think. <laughs> I think it's the exact opposite, right? I think non-Muslims won't leave Muslims and Islam alone. The non-Muslims like Robert Spencer and David Wood uh, and other critics of Islam are so obsessed with Islam that it's like, it's, 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 it's not even borderline psychotic. It's psychotic. It's, it's, like, it's, it's like a mental illness or something, right? I mean, Islam will leave you alone. Muslims will leave you alone. Islam will leave you alone. Read the Quran, chapter sixty, verse eight. Read, uh, 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 read the uh, the Quranic, uh, read the Quranic verses unto you, your religion, unto me, my religion. And no, those those verses aren't abrogated. Quran, chapter sixty, verse eight, is not abrogated. Unto you, your religion, unto me, my religion, is not abrogated. All right, like the Makkah surahs aren't abrogated by the Medinian surahs. There's no evidence for that. Um, uh, you know, so, uh, you know, like, like the whole issue is that when Robert Spencer said that, I was thinking the exact opposite is the case, right? Like, mo like non-Muslims won't leave Islam and Muslims alone. Islam and Muslims will leave non-Muslims alone. They're non-Muslims in Muslim lands, right? They're Arab Christians. Sam Shamoon is an Arab Christian, right? <laughs> Not all Arabs converted to Islam. A lot of them remain Christian. Right, so Islam will leave you alone. It's you non-Muslims. It, it's you non-Muslims who won't leave Islam alone. It's you non-Muslim critics who are obsessed with Islam who are going after Mo you non-Muslim critics like Robert Spencer, etc. Won't leave Islam alone. Islam will leave you alone. Read the Quran, chapter sixty, verse eight. Read the verses. Read the Quranic verses. Onto you, onto you, your religion. Onto me, my religion. Yes, Islam and Muslims will leave you alone. It's you non-Muslims who won't leave. Islam alone. <laughs> so the exact opposite is the case. Uh, so that's all I wanted to uh, say uh, about um, about that. Check out my uh, check out my video game collection. All right, thanks.